Hey guys, this is Andy Ray with Area Reptiles. Uh, another quick episode of Our Reptile Lifestyle. Not really a full episode, but this is just going to be an unboxing video. Um, and I just wanted to talk about how exciting it is uh, for anybody to get a, a new shipment and a new reptile coming into the collection. Um, you know, just to feel that anticipation and excitement, you know, it's, it's always a fun thing. Uh, I wanted to take an opportunity to do my first unboxing video on this channel. Um, and it happens to be a species that, uh, that I absolutely love. And this is a male jungle um, and uh, he's, uh, he was originally bred by Headhunter uh, and then uh, purchased by Andrew Paris from Paris Reptiles. Uh, again, a big shout out to Andrew for just the amazing care and love that he's put into his animals uh, and to offer me an opportunity to to literally jump ahead two or three years in my breeding of jungles uh, to get something that is uh, not only a fantastic animal um, but with lineage so it's a pedigree quality uh, jungle carpet I'm super thankful for that opportunity so thank you Andrew for that and um, let's get to it right it's like enough talking and let's actually see what we got so without further ado It's always fun when you're waiting for these for these packages because you know they're it's always it's actually it's nerve-wracking we got stuff sometimes coming all the way from across the United States it's overnight um, shipping mishaps what have you it can it can be a very nerve-wracking experience and I really want to commend Andrew for just the customer service the communication that he's got uh, worrying about the animals and caring enough to follow through and you know reaching out to me you know saying you know where is it at is it going okay everything okay um, you know that that's always a that's always a good thing in my opinion when it comes to customer service uh, one thing I would recommend guys is when you are unboxing for those of you that maybe have never received a package I really do prefer to do blade out blade up and just really try to pull the box up as you're cutting. So what can happen, and I've never seen it happen, I don't think it would be an issue, but if you're cutting down this way and it cuts into, let's say, the styrofoam or cuts further down than you're thinking, if for some reason your animal were to have gotten out of, of its original container, you wouldn't want to hurt it. Just minimize those chances. Um, blade up or scissors up or just very lightly hit that top edge of the tape. Just be real careful and mindful and take your time. This guy is going to be awesome, awesome addition to our collection. I'm definitely super excited. This, everybody, is Stark. Beautiful. Jungle male. Um, I have got some very specific plans for him. He just, he came up at the right time. Funny story, I actually was not gonna get him. Uh, Andrew was kind enough to offer him to me and I just kind of was going back and forth. The one thing for me, for sure, was the blacks on this guy. My plans are for Belle, another female, jungle female I have. Uh, she's got super dark blacks. And this guy's blacks just are dark, dark, dark. And, um, you know, I just, I wasn't in in a position really financially to, to, to really do it. And uh, I, I just needed to be responsible about it. So I was just like, you know, Andrew, I'm not gonna be able to do it. Then, and, and everything in me, I was trying to convince Andrew not to sell them or not to post them online. Then he posted them online. Well, I couldn't let just anybody have them, right? So of course, I had to get them. Uh, but he really does put me uh, a couple of years ahead of my, of my jungle breeding plans, which is fantastic. Uh, and he's got some fantastic pedigree. Uh, so, he, and he's a sweetheart. That was the, one of the biggest selling points uh, that talking with Andrew um, and you know, you guys, 
talk to the breeders that you're going to be purchasing something from, you know. Take the time to, uh, to chit chat with them. Um, you know, and Andrew telling me that he's puppy, puppy dog tame and very placid, uh, that was a huge selling point for me. I've got kids, you know, and uh, it's important for me to have animals that we can handle. Um, and uh, we, do, we do do presentations. Uh, and to have a, a, an animal this pretty and, and striking always garners attention. Um, and so that was a huge selling point for me, knowing that I've got an animal, I can go in there. Uh, if I feel like I want to handle a jungle, now I've got uh, another jungle that I can handle. So that was huge. Well, he's doing fantastic. He's doing great. Inquisitive, tongue flicking, it's always a great sign. And uh, he's going to be a happy boy here, huh? And his name will stay as Stark. Okay, say hi to the camera. Take it out. Well, that's Stark. He's awesome. Andrew, thank you again so much, man. This, is, this guy's awesome. I'm, I don't know if I've said awesome enough. <laughs> Alright guys, don't forget. Click the like button. Subscribe. And feel free to share. Take care. Have a good one.